So, so it's, been, it's been a week. It's been a week. Um, we're just like, whatever. 2020? Yeah. 2020? We got Taylor. Stay in your square, Taylor. Stay in your square. We got Taylor. Taylor in the corner. We're trying to. So it's been a week of wrecks and pandemics. And now pretty sure we're stuck in a freight elevator in our building in Charlotte. It's not that we're stuck. It's just that it won't go anywhere and we're pushing the buttons. I'm sure it's going to be okay. Stay tuned. Stay tuned, folks. Coming, coming at you live. It's about 940. Any appointments we have, uh, we'll be doing virtual from the elevator. Taylor, you can't just sit down and run it out here. <laughs> I'm trying not to panic. Don't panic. This, no. I'm, I'm, sure, I'm it's sure. Not like we're suspended up in the floor. We could, floor we could survive. We have coffee. We have coffee. <laughs> Starbucks. We could survive like three days. And yeah, at least. I don't want to be stuck in your for three days. Uh, maybe we could virtual the office in and do some work. I'm not making this up. I could not make this up. What's that box do? Uh, it's a phone. Is it a phone? Is it, there's no phone? That's a button. Just yeah. try your card though before we okay. Somebody call the security guard. It's, it's right here. I, I think we can just try Greg's. Okay. Oh, seven's back on. That just keeps doing that. No. Bring you further updates? Yeah, go ahead. You have activated this emergency telephone. Connecting <laughs> Okay. Good job there. A live emergency operator is being connected now. This message may repeat. You have activated this emergency. You remember last night it was making some noises when we came down there? Yeah. Second push did not work. Okay, yeah, you can go ahead and release that door open button if you haven't done so already. How many people are on the elevator? Three. I'm oh, sorry, say again. <laughs> Three. Uh, I know you said to just confirm what floor is the elevator currently on. Uh, yeah, we're in here. We're trying to get out. <laughs> it's not working. There are three people on this elevator. I believe we're on the first floor, but the, uh, the lights above are not working. Only the lights on the panel are working. And, uh, last question, does anyone require immediate medical attention? No. Okay, for your safety, please make sure you stay clear of the doors and do not try to pry them open. Okay. okay. I am going to disconnect the call now, but I'll be calling for help right away, so please hold me back uh, if anything changes or if you need anything else, okay? Okay, thank you. Would you believe that I actually know the guy who maintenances these elevators? He's a friend of mine. I'm not going to call no. his name right now. What'd you say? Okay, yeah, uh, it's not moving for us. Did you say you're going to go to the roof and reset the elevator? Yeah. Okay. Good. Thanks. Okay. Comforting. As long as we don't take an express ride. <laughs> <laughs> I want to take an express ride to the basement. I mean, it's only. <laughs> Man, we're over with a bunch of kids. We're at least 10 minutes into this. Fifteen. Huh? Like 10 minutes in here. It's only 10 minutes. Yeah. Get kind of hot with my coat on. We're in a freight elevator. Don't worry, the other elevators are totally safe if you're coming to see us in Charlotte. The freight elevator might be having some problems today. I'm not gonna mess with it. 
But you know why I'm totally calm right now? All calm as cucumber. Do you know why I'm cool as a cucumber right now? Because I have my estate plan in order. There you go. I do. Sit in the closet at home. I'm worth a lot more dead than alive anyway. That might be something to consider. I'm saying. Hmm. Hope we get through this. Stay tuned for the dramatic conclusion of <laughs> something that's totally unplanned. And if he knows what he's doing, how we talk to them, if that interferes with whatever's going on. I'm just not sure what Tony, the security guard. No, I, I trust you, Tony. It's Tony, the maintenance. Tony, the maintenance guy. I'm sorry. Yeah. Tony, the maintenance guy, yelled through the door that he's going to the roof to reset the elevator. Oh. Whoa! Oh. Look at that. We out. You don't think we should take? We're free. Yeah. Thanks, man. I, I left my mask. We're good. It's kind of scary, though. I've never been stuck in an elevator before. That's my first time. That wouldn't be bad. It wouldn't be bad. So now we're going to get on another elevator and go up. Okay. Seventh floor. If you're in Charlotte, you can get your estate plan done at our office, short walk away, plan for a lifetime on a lunchtime, and go up the nice elevators to the seventh floor, which is the perfect floor. 